You're walking on the beach, the sun's warm, waves are soft, then the ocean disappears, water pulls back, far beyond the horizon. People stop, confused, then you hear it, deep, distant, ancient, a sound no one forgets. A wall of water is coming, not just big, apocalyptic. Tsunamis are nature's most terrifying punchlines. And these three? They're the worst of the worst. Welcome to Curious Minds. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe, hit the bell icon, and give this video a thumbs up. First stop, Japan, 2011. It started with a 9.0 magnitude earthquake off the coast of Tohoku. The ground shook for six endless minutes, but the real terror didn't come from below, it came from the sea. A massive tsunami rose up, with waves reaching 40 meters in some places. Entire towns were swallowed. Over 18,000 lives were lost in a matter of hours. And then, Fukushima. The wave struck a nuclear power plant, unleashing a second disaster that no one saw coming. Next, the Indian Ocean, 2004. Tourists lounged on beaches, children played in the sand. Then, a 9.1 to 9.3 magnitude earthquake struck beneath the Indian Ocean. It ruptured the seafloor along 1,600 kilometers, longer than the entire state of California. What followed was pure devastation. Waves, some over 30 meters high, tore across 14 countries. From Indonesia to India to Sri Lanka, the ocean showed no mercy. More than 230,000 people were killed. One moment, life was normal. The next, entire coastlines had been erased. Finally, Alaska, 1958. This one didn't hit a crowded city. It didn't cause a nuclear meltdown. But what it did? No tsunami in history has ever matched it. A 7.8 magnitude earthquake struck along the Fairweather Fault in southeast Alaska. It triggered a massive rock slide into the narrow Latuya Bay, dumping millions of tons of earth into the water. The result? A wave that rose to 524 meters. That's taller than the Empire State Building, taller than most mountains. It ripped trees from the earth, stripped entire hillsides bare. Boats were thrown like toys. Two people died, but only because almost no one was there. If it had struck anywhere else, the death toll would have been unthinkable. It wasn't the deadliest. But it was, without question, the most powerful wave ever witnessed by human eyes. These weren't just waves, they were moments when the earth itself screamed. And the next time the sea falls eerily silent, remember, it might just be taking a deep breath. Now I have to ask, do you know of a tsunami even more terrifying? Drop it in the comments, I read every single one. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. See you in the next video. Stay safe out there.